The Quest Sound Pro 2900 Sound Level Meter SLM comes with instruction manual located behind the top lid, windscreen, microphone, USB conversion cable, extra alkaline batteries, data download cable, CD software, calibration certificate, the unit itself, wrist strap, and screwdriver. If requested, you will also receive the Octave Band Analyzer 300. Please confirm that you have received everything. To get started, attach the wrist strap to your wrist and the microphone to the unit. If you are taking a survey outdoors, you will also want to attach the windscreen. Press the on-off button to turn the unit on. The unit will immediately begin to take readings after a short diagnostics check, but will not be data logging. The unit has been preset and pre-calibrated. If you would like to verify, perform a pre- and or post-calibration. You will need to order the calibrator. See the Quest Noise Pro calibration video for instructions on calibration. To data log, push the Run Pause button. An arrow appears in the top left-hand corner of the screen and a timer starts. When your survey is complete, pause the unit by pushing the Run Pause button. The arrow changes to a double bar and you have created a study within a session. You can now download the data, install the CD software, attach the data transfer cable to the side of the unit and to the USB port on the PC, if no serial port is available. Follow the instructions on the PC to install the Quest Suite Professional if this is the first time using the software. Open the software by clicking on Sound and then click on Model 2900 from the window. Click on Setup in Toolbar, System Options, and then Communications. Click on the correct COM port and then click OK. Click on Retrieve Instrument Data. Name your file and click on Retrieve Data. Data will start to be downloaded. Report files will open when done. Click on the report file you want to review. You can print or export to another document. To export, go to Report tab, envelope icon, and select your report format and click OK. Then Name and Save. When done, close out of the software, disconnect everything, repack and ship back to Galson Laboratories. Model 2900 with the Octave Band Analyzer 300. Follow the setup procedure for the 2900 sound level meter and at the end attach the octave band analyzer 300 by screwing it in place. Careful! Do not over tighten. You can use the OBA in either manual or auto mode. Manual mode you must use the up and down arrows to switch to the frequencies you wish to analyze. To start auto mode move the switch to auto and press the start button. The unit will go through each set of frequencies. In either mode, you can survey using full octave or one-third of an octave by changing the time mode from 1-1 one, one for full octave to 1-3 one, for one-third octave. To go into data log mode, go into auto mode, push the run button. When the survey is complete, press the pause button and then push the memory button and then the enter button. This captures all data for all frequencies as one data set for your report. Follow the same instructions for the retrieval of the data as for the 2900 sound level meter. When done, turn off the unit by pushing and holding the off button. After a brief countdown to zero, release the button. Remove the software CD and repack to ship back to Galson Laboratories. Questions? Contact Galson Laboratories by phone, email, or IH live chat. You may also access our extensive library of other helpful videos at galsonlabs.com. Thank you.